I'm all wrapped up in my goblin cocoon, and I'm ready for some gaming here on this lovely Sunday evening. Hello. I'm wrapped up in a cocoon like a goblin because exams are hard. Gonna see how long I can last in this cocoon before I get too hot. But, uh, rest assured, my feet will still remain fucking frozen. So, no worries there. I've got my tea. That's, um, a little watered down tasting, but, you know. We take what we can get. So, uh, I'm now almost certain upon, oops, wrong button, upon reviewing the files that Northmore, the director before Trench, uh, yes, the tea is up to date. <laughs> I'm drinking cold brewed hop tea. Um, so Northmore, who was the director before Trench, um, is in the power plant powering the place because Trench talks about how Northmore is like, uh, he says this whole thing where like a director's most basic duty is to keep the lights on. And that Northmore stepped down, but he didn't have much of a choice. And there's a couple of other sort of vague things. So, yeah. So, Northmore, who's apparently also had a lot of, like, paranatural potential, just like Jesse and, and Dylan do, uh, was forced out of directorship seemingly because he became corrupted or something. And then was uh, yoded into the power plant. Or to keep the lights on, literally. Yeah, ignore this um big splatter of fire hydrant. I just uh wanted to test how loud the sound was. All right, here we are again. Once again, back at it again. Gaming, yeet. Oh. I love how I can just freeze their explosions. Feels good. Come on, sir. Let us duel. Ah, shit. Here we go again. Indeed. Also, welcome both Lucas and me. I'm glad for you guys joining me. While I make a mockery of this game with my poor, poor gaming skills. That we've played, that's just the... So, I also solved that, I think. The, um, the, uh, uh, transcripts or the recordings of her, um, psych evals, her, like, talks with the psychiatrist, uh, were uh, apparently procured after um, trying to find it. Hold on. Uh, da, 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 da.
There isn't there a hmm. well somewhere in all this fucking shit is uh, it, it says that uh, that they were procured from her. So it sounds like uh, oh you you mean like this? <laughs> um. It, it sounds like uh, Jesse was just at a really, really shit therapist. <laughs> and that and that they were uh, they were later uh, like retroactively grabbed here in the middle of New York, recordings. And nobody saw a thing. Pretty unbelievable. You know it, Jesse. I also killed the uh, anchor that was crashing us last time. Um, I had to turn on cheats for it because it is apparently a bug with the game and uh, I think AMD processors. Uh, there's a whole thing where, as far as I can tell, uh, there's two bugs. One of them is that it creates so many clocks that it literally crashes the game because the game is trying to load all the clocks, which is hilarious, uh, but also not very good for completing the game and the other thing is that apparently there's a bug where if it sh if it eats a clock at one of the fl guys flying around it will crash the game so essentially i had to turn on like god mode and just obliterate it but can i thank you um oh i fucked that up immediately Fuck. But yeah, so I beat it, and there wasn't really a whole lot of lore or anything. Uh, it was interesting enough, but nothing really worth mentioning. Ah! Ah! Here I am laughing at having decked him from the back with that thing, and then he just <laughs> I just get blown up. All right, I gotta find a better way to deal with these floaty boys. I suppose that's one way of doing it. Oh, for a second there, he bugged out. It looked like he was like climbing forward at me. Ugh. You guys see that? Fuck. Alright, gotta go get some health. Gotta go get some health. Okay, there's multiple boys throwing stuff at me. I gotta go up. Uppies! Uh. This guy's a wily one. Fuck off, Jesus. Mr. Flying Boy. Doesn't look like his shield. Oh my god, okay, I'm dead. Uh. Tell me there's some health around here somewhere. Hello? Okay, he does recharge his shield after a while. Right, I think my only hope is to kill that guy. Get his health. Come on. Let me let me put up my shield. Ooh, Lord. Give me the health. Come on, there's health over here somewhere. Oh, there. Okay, 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 okay. We're healthy again. Car door. Fuck. No! No shooting. Only I shoot. Oh, I grabbed him. We should check that lab. <laughs> I was like, where did he go? <laughs> but I just I got him here. Look at his look at his fun neck. Look, he's having a great time. Look at him. Look at him go. Whee. 
What should we do with him? Uh, trash compacted stuff. I bet this place fucking reeks, dude. How about you go up there? You want to go up there? Have fun. Oh. Threw him a little too hard, I think. It wasn't on purpose. Any goodies. My search for goodies continues. One day I will have them all. Hello? Come on, they've got to be hiding some goodies here somewhere. Aha! Boop. I guess this is the way forward, I'm imagining. Yeah, okay. I'm going to check this lab. So there are also slides in the slide. Oh, hello. What is this? An album cover. Okay. Um, there are also slides that were within the slide projector that um, Jesse apparently burned them uh, when the AWE at Ordinary happened, uh, which uh, the Bureau was unhappy about. I like how this, this bike has been taken out. Um, and uh, the only remaining one is the slide of a hand, which is is what um we I, I know Mia right we the point of every game is goodies um apparently the hand is what released Polaris and Polaris they weren't born with their powers apparently Polaris gave them their powers or at least that's what is implied Oh, it looks like it's another darling post uh, discovering the hiss. Effective immediately. I'm setting up a new department. Dimensional research in the research sector. Uh, transferring the slide projector there. Oh. That's where my focus will be now. The ordinary site remains as is. We'll be back to. Okay, so this wasn't actually after he figured out about the hiss. Darling took the projector to the research sector. He dedicated a whole area to it, so he knew it was important. Dimensional research. That's where we go next. God, I hate that smile that Dylan does. Ugh. So, um... Finish Tango? Oh my god. Hold on a minute. Finish Tango? Do I do I get to talk to Assi? Okay. So many fucking side quests. I've also got to hit up a control point because I got a bunch more level ups now wait I didn't press the button hello button Boop. oh we're back here well, isn't that very Skyrim of you, Control? Just floating along. Don't mind me. Make sure that I'm going the right way. I think I'm going. Yeah, I think this is the right way. Control point. Okay. Let's assign these abilities. Uh, so I've got. I do want more health, I do want more energy, but also, plus three, I've got four. Ground slam is fun, but I feel like, I feel like I either have to never use it or put all my points into it, because if it costs all of my energy when I use it, so it has to be like a one-hit KO. 
once I have enough points, I might reset my abilities, get rid of the ones in like in shield and and some of the other ones, and and throw a bunch into the flying and stuff. But for now, I think I'm just gonna more health. Can fast travel back to dimensional research. I don't know why I'm starting to go the long way. Research. Ooh, I have to go through the ashtray maze. Nice. So the ashtray maze is uh, basically it's an altered item or an object of power that is an ashtray and a cigar. And I think a cigar or a cigarette. And the uh, uh, it oh hello friends haven't seen you guys in a while, and it uh, it it acts as like an in impenetrable maze unless you are bound to the object or you give people the ability to go through it with the object. Ooh. Uh oh. Sir? I have to ask you all to stop. God, what a shield on this guy. Fuck off, Jesus. Okay, that doesn't work. Gaming. Oh, fuck. Well, isn't that just convenient? There was a little throughway right into dimensional research. Just look at that. Yeah, okay, I get it. I've got metal on me. What of it? Okay, I can't do that. So these fire breaks are also made of black rock, apparently. The stuff that they mine in the quarry in order to keep... Dangerous things contained on the other side. Oh, Polaris has has something to say to me. Bro. Contact the janitor if you need to get through. Broken? How many dead ends can this place have? We need to find Ati. Hell yeah! Ati, Ati, Ati. Janitor's office. Ventilation. Close. It's time to find RT. Our boy. Uh, this way. Oh. Cho. Oh shit, sorry, that was a friend. Whoops! So this is part of a quest, this guy, I think. This was one of yep. Ranger buddies. Yep. I should find the others. F's in chat for Arisha's Ranger buddies. Whoa, what the? F I'm sure it's fine. Ati's got things under control. Ati. 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 
this way. <laughs> no, Artie. Oh, for fuck's sake! I want to talk to my boy. Oh, okay. Some some new jobs for me. So I'll collect them all and never do them. A panther. Oh, Ati said he was going on vacation. Now this boy left, said the son of Anniki dad. My assistant will give work in the club and the house standy. Lomile lumps, holiday humps. How can anyone even get out of here while the building is sealed? Let alone go on holiday. Ati's having a good fucking time, and you know what? That's ah! That's what matters. This guy's fucking tonky, dude. Oh! Don't stand that close to the minigun. Is there an enemy somewhere? Oh. Wow. <laughs> Fucking spooked me. He does deserve a vacation. You're right. Okay. I assume I can't go through here. Nope. I bet you. Hey. I bet you that's the way back out again after I've done the mission. Oh, fuck. Fuck. Ati, dude, this place ain't looking so good. Okay, I see that Polaris is there, but also. Okay, that's nothing. That's just the goodies. Gotta get the goodies. Okay, Polaris, let's do this. Oh, this one was easy. There's not a whole lot of weirdness here. Okay. Oh, no. We're gonna have to do more gross mold it's boys, aren't we? Two? Yep. Oh, they can shoot stuff. I love that for me. Oh, fuck. What the shit? Let's try and bottleneck them a little bit here. Ah! Fuck off. Fucking vomit all over me. Really? They just keep coming, huh? Fuck! I love this, like, ethereal, haunting Finnish melody that Ati is singing throughout this whole thing.
I feel like it might be important to go down there. If nothing else, but for the goodies sake. But also... <sighs> the call. The call of goodies. I cannot resist. Goodies. Bloop. I know, right, Lucas? The goodies, they call to us. Man, what a throw, huh? Okay, we got regular hiss down here. Come on, my guy. I think I've got him by the leg. Music stopped. The search commences. Furnace chamber, huh? I really hope at some point they explicitly confirm or deny whether or not Northmore is in the, uh, the NSC. You know, Lucas, I would say that I was pulling his leg. Didn't I already fix these things? I hear some boys screaming at me. Some gamers screaming into the void. Ah! Any gamers? Hey, gamers. Wow. Nailed it. Got him. Oh, fuck. Did that do it? No, I still hear fight music. Oh, and screeching. Sir? Ha! The music has ceased. Okay. We got a couple of coolant pumps working. This one here that goes that way. One here that goes that way. Cooling water. Alright. We have to shoot the fucking clog again, don't we? Love me some clog. Yeah, me too, Thunder Lizards. The, uh, the water on oil effect, the sort of, like, where you sh when I shoot them, it kind of mimics blood in a way. Quite like that. It's the same effect that's sort of, uh, it's on everything, really. Um. Okay, I guess I don't have to clear the clog. Um. Like, every, every time, um, people move around in cutscenes and stuff, it's also sort of vaguely there. I pointed it out before, but I, I really like it. All right, as far as I can tell, I just have to... Ah, 
Oh, really? Ah. Wrong gun. Got him. Alright, I guess we just go up to Ati's vision now. Can I climb up here? Nope. Stop screaming at me. Got him. Okay, I think that was everyone. Now we gotta go up. How the fuck am I gonna get up there? Can I just float far enough to get over? It's like that. Ah. Oh. Hey. <laughs> Intended game design. Definitely not me doing a dumb thing. And it working out for no reason. Okay. Oof. God, I'm fucking dying. My cocoon has served its use. I now emerge as a beautiful gamer butterfly. <sighs> and three. Felt like that was four times, but okay. Oh, we've got a ding doorbell. Oh, fuck off. This shit again? Ah, the soothing tones of Ati speaking Finnish. You think he's... I'm tuning them all so that he does an incantation to get rid of the clog? Yeah, 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 there we go. The clog can't stand Ati's voice. Who's what fella in the doorway? This? That's a that's a ladder. Or did you mean the clog? It's just our good friend the clog. See, now he's been vaporized because Ati is Ati is love, Ati is life. Wait, what? I only have to go through the inverted black pyramid door. Do I not have to do that this time? Can't tune that one. I only have to go through there. Where am I supposed to go? Guess I'll check these rooms again, huh? I don't see any Atsy visions either to guide me on my way. Oh wait, janitor door! 
I gotta go to the janitor door. Ain't that just a kick in the pants? Okay, I hope Ati will teach me some- Oh, I love this. They're like jury rigged. Oh my god, look at that. They're all jury rigged, like, constructions of different random debris. I wish Atsi would teach me his uh, wondrous finish incantation so that I could just banish the blob with the power of my voice. Danger over there, it looks like. I get him? I think I got him. Nope. He's still floating. Ah. Not quite. I'll oh, take care, Mia. Thanks for joining. Get fucked. Thank you also for Cozy Company. Hope you enjoyed your stay. I don't know what this indicator is supposed to mean. It's like normally when there's danger somewhere, but it doesn't look like... I mean, I guess there's that guy. I don't know why I thought I was going to be able to hit those shots. Come on. One more. Got him. Okay, so one is restricted area. Going down. How the fuck did Asi get down here? What strange Finnish eldritch mysteries does this man possess to allow him to traverse this place? Not see any goodies. What? Oh, I thought that was a regular dude for a second. Sorry, bud. Ooh. Kinda juiced some of the uh controls, huh? Beep. Oh. Hey guys. Fuck. Yowza. Oh, what? What the fuck? I didn't mean it. Ah! Come on, these guys have to drop some health. Okay, they did. Woo! What was that? What did I even throw at him? Okay, that was a grenade. You fucking spawned right next to me? Seriously, my guy? Yeah, I guess... I guess, Lucas, being Finnish is, for all intents and purposes, equal to possessing crazy powers. Try that again, huh? Take a sip of my tea.
Can I just not deal with those guys? That'd be really lovely. I could just sort of... Oh, I didn't have the running. Oh, they're fighting the... The Squibbly Boy. Oh, that's not my problem. And a little bit of a run. Hey, they're just fighting the flashy boy. He needn't even interfere. Just drop to my untimely demise, I guess. Alright, let's try this again. Do I have to press the button? Yeah, I think so. Sorry. Business is business. Let's try not to get hit by that guy's thing again, huh? Okay, that time I had a shield up and everything. So I'm gonna go ahead and call bullshit on that one. The timing. How? How could this be? Man, I'm just slowly peeling off all these layers, huh? I started as a cocoon goblin, and now I'm... I'm gonna end up naked by the end of the stream. No, I'm not. Twitch, don't. Don't. Ooh, goodies. I missed these goodies. See? It was all intentional, so I could get... The goodies. Yeah, don't don't tell Twitch. They'll sue me. Okay, I thought maybe there were more goodies I'd missed, but I didn't. <sighs> Third time's the charm, eh? Let's see if we can clock this boy one. Kidding me? Where did those papers come from? Stop, fucker! Oh, that's the way, huh? God, this guy's tonky, huh? Got him! Oh. Really? Don't come any closer. Ah! Oh, fuck off two of them. No. I'm bad at this game. I gotta sit in my by stance in order to attain greater video gaming acuity. We're speed running. Do you think we put this here for exactly this 
scenario because <laughs> they knew he'd be running back a couple times. Because that's a, that's a hard fight. Oh, no, I did it wrong again. It's weird. She can't run unless you're already facing the direction that you want to run in. And the, like... Assume, yes, I have assumed the by gamer stance. The, like, command for it is a little wonky. So it is a little tough to uh, set up these, these mad ups, but... I guess I could do that as well. Hey, Sancha. Welcome to the Gamer Cave. We are uh, beautiful gamer butterflies today. Alright, let's try this again. Did not do it in the cool way last time. So now... Got him! Come on, bud. Get hacked. Don't do it, Anakin. I have the high ground. Wonder how many prequel memes I can make. You guys just wait until I see some sand. Ooh boy. Also, Wormst. I don't know if it was a save so much as it was just like total luck that I didn't instantly get obliterated. Okay, that didn't work. Fucking die! <laughs> it ain't pretty, but it'll do the job. Alright, nerds. God, these random explosive things they've scattered around here are really not for me. I'd like it if maybe... Oh, really? No one saw that. Turn to sender. Okay, please. No more now. We done? Can we be done? Can I be done? I hear Ati's sonorous tones. Take me away, Yahtzee. Please tell me I don't have to fight people on this thing. Please no, the flying controls can be a little janky. Don't do this to me. My gamer senses are tingling in a bad way. We've got the soundtrack. We've got the arena. Nowhere. We've got the text. They're going to make me fight people, aren't they? I get it. Suspense. Yeah. 
Jeez, huh? Couldn't have uh, beefed this bad boy up a little bit. Yeah, no, apparently they're not going to make me fight, but I uh, almost wish they did now. <laughs> Bit of a trek. It's only so much artsy suspense I can take. All right, that's enough of that. Get me out of here. So this button is glowing, but I can't press it. Like, it's got light on it and everything. Something up ahead. Do you see it? I hate. I hate statements like that. Oh, sauna. Gotta be a sauna, right? He's finished. Any goodies scattered amongst this mess? Oh, did he open a beer? I think he's making fun of Swedish people. This is a relatable Danish mood. Okay, I don't think they put any uh, weird shit over here. So. Hey, bird. Oh, it's me. Yeah, I get it. Adi? <laughs> Did you miss me? That sounds sinister. Did you have this in your shop? Yes. Adi? <laughs> no, 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 no. Adi? Don't make a bone. You did good. Take my cassette player. You can borrow it. The song is a present from my friends to you. It will get you through the maze so you can do your job. Did that really just happen? Of course it did. He gave me his cassette player. It'll get me through the maze, huh? The janitor always has the keys. It's gotta be an altered item, huh? Or a, an oop. Abilities. Ooh, I can reset them. I'm gonna do it. Forty-five, huh? Damn. Okay, let's see. What do we want our build to be? I feel like the shield costs a lot. I do like the propelled debris, but I honestly don't feel like I hit it that much. So I think I'm going to do and all of these. Get this. Get, be able to throw things back. Be able to throw people. Gotta be able to throw people. It's very important. Gotta get some health. More energy. We'll focus on energy and health, and then we'll leave that for now. And then we'll go... I do want launch damage. Launch damage is very good. I think I'll go this later, but I do want a couple durations because I don't want to be dropping when I think I have more time. I can wait with getting those. Oh, that's insane, dude. All right, we got to get we got to get that. We got to be able to launch multiple objects. Oh, my God, I can afford it. Oh, OK, I thought I could afford it. I could not. We're going to save up for it then. New countermeasures. I got this back. Wow. Rated M for mature. 
Love that. All right. Whoops. Oh, I have to go to the research. Actually use this. The sort of level pathing in this game is impeccably well designed. Like the fact that they gave me this like fast travel point and then like guided me through a bunch of random like ways to get somewhere else was pretty cool. All right, we've done this a little bit before. Oh. I don't like the implication that these shoes make. How are you guys in here? Hey! Heck off! Damn, my fucking yeet does damage now. I'm liking this. Let's go! Metal is a good choice. You can tell when I think I've got the one gun out because I'm just spamming the button. Fucking like power metal y. Oh, dude. This is trippy as hell. Uh. Okay. Oh, Jesus. Feels like watching Doctor Strange for the first time when he goes through all those weird, crazy, mind-bending scenarios. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, elevator. Nice. Okay. Psych, I guess I don't have to fight them. Oh, I do. Okay, heat! This slaps, dude. I'm so here for this. My, my melee does nothing. It's going to require a little bit of focus here. Damn, that thing just took him out, huh?
They really went for it with ah! They really went for it with this song. It lasts forever. Let me in. I haven't seen The Shining, but I imagine, uh, from what I've heard of it, that it definitely... It's- well, yeah, it's, it's set in, like, the 60s or 70s, right? Kinda has that vibe. The weird colored wallpaper and stuff. Oh, hello, guys. <laughs> you know it, Jesse. The expedition to the slides gate thirty six. What darling brought back changed everything. What did darling bring back? Let's take our bets on whether or not we think darling is going to be the final yeah, boss. Finding the projector was how this all began. What started in ordinary ends here. You, me, Dylan. We've all come full circle. Ha. Knew there would be. Sand! Of course, that's why it gets everywhere. See? Prequel meme number two. Got one more in me, if the situation allows. And then I have used up all of my prequel things. Jokes, memes, references. Whatever you want to call them. Alright. Real quick. Got to go check my mod. Alright. Anything good here? A lot of things that I could crunch up, but nothing exceedingly interesting. Already got 7% accuracy. I do want the damage against armor on this, I think. That's good, but the zoom boost, I think I can actually get rid of and replace it with this, because that is very strong. And... Can I upgrade Pierce? No. Insufficient materials. He knows. All right. Ooh. There was a doorway here to where Dylan and I went, where the projector took us, where we met you. The bureau opened the same door here, but there's just an echo now. Echo. Are you close? Just on the other side? That's it. Wait, am I gonna get to meet Polaris? That'd be cool. Uh, 
anything up here? Looks like there's some goodies. Hello? Anybody home? Laris? Darling? Projector room is that way, which means we automatically will go the opposite way to get the goodies. I must have them. I will have them all. All of the goodies. For me. Me alone. There might be goodies in here as well. Alright. Let's go back up. Go to the projector room. And let's hex some guys. Some guy. Some things. Meet Polaris. I have no clue what's in store for me, honestly. Ooh. So clean and tidy in here. Gone. The projector's not here. Moved again. What did Darling do with it? What did I Darling really do out. with it, indeed? What say thee? Bill and sister burned the rest in ordinary before we could intercept. That's me, bitch. The text on it, color slide film, this side towards screen, and the number 36. The topography of slide scape... Maybe of his, you know. ...deep wave marks. On the slide and in the distance, there's a formation of five pillars, like crude, outstretched fingers. There were casualties on our first expedition. Communication is an issue. There is no sound there, as if you've gone deaf. And radios don't work. Correction, a resonance from an unknown source, in part within the range of audible frequency. It acts in unpredictable ways, causing feedback loops that can tear you apart. Is that Polaris? Trench insists he heard something else. It made his ears bleed. Our equipment found no evidence of anything beyond the primary resonance. Trenches, medical tests show nothing amiss. Ooh, Darling looked a little worried there. <laughs> the projected image. Okay, yeah, we saw. Okay, okay, okay. A physical portal into another dimension. Any more goodies? Dylan's sister burned the rest in ordinary before. Blue? This just brings me back down now. Okay, well. <laughs> That answers that, huh? Developers are like, stop with the side detours. Oh, boy. Side projector tests. More fractals from, from Darling. Hydrogen contain. Hello? Why, it certainly is spooky in here. It would be a shame if someone were to leap out at me and scare the living daylights out of me, wouldn't it? Yes, what a shame. Oh, wait. Isn't that it? Ah, fuck. 
There we go. Expedition three. We located the source of the resonance. Oh shit! <laughs> He's coming unhinged. It is an entity, a living organism of a considerable mass. I I've named it Hedron based on its physical shape. Hedron. We we we, we built this that... for it. You? Yes, Polaris, Polaris. You here? Is that why you <gasps> he didn't. You're here. You're here. They have you. I know you. I remember from ordinary. I did not see this coming. I thought I'd never see you again. Bruh. Hang on, I'm coming. Bruh. Fuck that, I can just do this. Through here? You are coming through so strong. Darling used this HRA to lock the door. I have to rip it off to get in. Are you sure? Okay, I'll be there. Hang on. Whoa. You can't shake the feeling that maybe, just maybe, we're doing the wrong thing, huh? Yeah, Darling is a little sexy. It's it's very unsettling. Hi. I made it. was a mistake hey Julie you've arrived just in time for uh, this terrifying nightmare to unfold welcome enjoy button Oh, I gotta... Okay. I gotta... Th okay, they're all trying to get in. Oh, yeah, Jesse, tell him! Tell him, Queen! Yeet! Yeah, me too. I also love Nightmares. Let's, uh... Let's go on it to get us, you know, let's adventure through this nightmare hellscape together. Just, just, just all of us, you know, here, released from our gamer goblin chrysalis, glorious butterflies that we are. Becoming brothers and sisters and other queer Unending potentialities in arms together. Oh wow, nailed it. Through this nightmare. Yes, thank you for catching Julia Lucas. Because I sure as fuck cannot do it right now. Although the VOD will, of course, as always, be available after the stream, should you wish to peruse it at your viewing leisure. Mommy? Well, they, well, we don't know if they're not nice. Yeah, we're, but, but, but maybe not, but we're, we're like, ah! oh, come on. Man. Okay. Look, I know that this looks like it's my fault, but the fucking flying controls are... <laughs> A little janky. 
I will cut this game a lot of slack because it, it kicks ass in a lot of areas, but the controls are a little screwy. Oh man, do I have to do all that? Fuck. Don't you, that was a little cringe me. I'm doing my best. A uh, what? Oh, man. What happened if I were to just have died there organically? I was just going to have to run this dumb gauntlet again? Hey, darling. Yada, yada, yada. Wait, what was that? Nothing. Yeah, you better you better take that back. Be nice to me. I'm vulnerable. I just handed in my exam and I've only just become a gamer butterfly. My delicate wings are still still you know delicate. Okay, so... Okay, so that was just a fake door? Wow, this is fucking cute. Oh, it was the other end! I see. Okay, alright, I get it now. I get it, I get it. And it saved my place here as well, that's nice. Alright, I think I can just... Please, 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 please. Nice. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Fuck. Hey, uh, nope. Eat ass. Oh, fuck off with all this shit, dude. dude this thing heals them fast, and I do not like that. Can't even get health back from them. Okay. Health over there. Please. Don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. <laughs> Die, you fucking orb. Get pondered. Oh. Oh, ye of little faith, Lucas. Thou dost forget that I am God! God Gamer! My mods are full. I'm God Gamer, but not God Gamer enough to carry all of these mods. That'll do. All right. I guarantee that freeing Polaris is a bad idea somehow. Cause um. Get the fuck away. Cause like, are the are the hiss? Are they trying to like hurt it, or are they also trying to free it? You know. And, like, darling, like, you know, taking control of it. Oh, my God. Could I run, please? Darling, like, taking control of it would be a classic, like, delve too deep and awaken something in the darkness kind of story. The only question is then why the Hiss are fighting me. But that might just be for Polaris to keep up appearances. I don't know. Really? Oh, okay, wait. Huh. It's okay, we're good. <laughs> Jessica, her name is Jesse, but... Uh, I think it's because, you know, Polaris couldn't, couldn't get in without Jesse. 
Because Jesse lifted the, um, the lockdown. Fuck. At least in terms of this theory, but who knows. <laughs> Don't be sorry, I'm just teasing. Alright, how do we get back up there? Ah, yes. An, a convenient elevator. It's... Mind me just falling off the freaking thing again. Man, every time I fall off that, my fucking heart just. <laughs> How about you guys? Is it as good for you as it is for me? Up we go. Alright, where's that nugget? Did I kill him on the way down? Yep, doesn't sound like there's any combat music anymore. Alright, Polaris. They look like they're trying to free it, I'm not gonna lie. Ow! What the... Eat ass. Give me more health orbs. I must ponder them. Oh, really? Fuck! Maybe that's why they need me. If they're not very good at it. I don't know, I'd really like it not to be the case, because I like Polaris, but... I'm just a little sus, is all. Oh my god, could I get like two seconds? Bro! Two seconds, that's all I ask. Okay, it made the... Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Just something is just off, I think, is where I'm... Nailed it. I think I can just get across like this. Ugh. Nailed it. Fuck. 
Fuck! Dude! Oh! Oh my god, are you see? He just punched me for like all my health! My guy! Alright, now we know this time I don't have to go the long, stupid way, right? I can just go up, and then I can go to the back instead of the front. Yeah. See? Gamer brain right there. It's that gamer brain. Yeah, one punch man is fucking right. Okay. It looks like we're back where we were before. I felt like I saw another one of those funky little elevator boys. To take me up to the, uh... Yeah, but perhaps I was mistaken. Yep. Alright. Time to do a little run around. Yeah, I seem to shrug off bullets like it's nothing, and then this lad punches me, and I just get fucking decked. I was a little afraid I wasn't going to make that, but... Hey, that's not going to work. Okay. Okay. Possibly. That's interesting. But Darling was saying something about uh, the uh, the hiss or about letting the, letting Hedron in on one of the uh, the things. Uh, talking about like the different like resonance and stuff like that. And he was saying like that he that he let Hedron in and he was going a little wild from it. And if he talked, if he called Hedron. They call Polaris Hedron. Then, like... That's all I have to say. And you know what? I live by that. Oh! Fucking... Alright, I gotta get rid of... Can't get me from up there. Yes, yes, dance monkeys. Oh, shit. God, these guys suck. Hey. Hey, guys, you suck. Oh, fuck off. Luckily, I spotted this elevator before my untimely demise. Thank you, Leon. My dance moves are... Oh, not as good as Jesse's, apparently, but... You know, they're a, they're there's something. All right, buds. Oh yeah, get fucked. Oh god, these guys suck so bad. Eat a whole entire ass. Oh, another one. Oh, it's not another one. Okay, thank God. It's just this boy and his friend. My exam has put me in a bit of a weird mood, as you can see. Jesus Christ, that thing fucking whipped past my ear.
Ah. I was like, where is he? Found him. Uh oh, it's a named boy. Shit. Jesse's grunts of frustration are very relatable. It is pretty cool, Leon. Uh, it's uh, I don't know, it's very well designed. Uh, it's got a couple of couple of you know things here and there, but in general, I really really like it. You you are joining me at the climax though, so there's a lot of spoilers if you're uh, if you're in not interested in those, you might want to sit this one out. <laughs> Reach Polaris, boy. Would I love to do that? Uh, oh. no. The poster comes down and there's nothing there. It's just the cell and death. I was wrong. There was never anything there. Hello? Polaris, are you there? Please, no, please, 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 Oh, wait, wait, wait. We're not done yet, baby. Uh... Federal Bureau of Control, how can uh, I help you? I need those field reports typed up and in management's hands first thing the tomorrow. The Bureau's the best at what it does, protecting everyday Americans from foreign threats. Here's the new girl, standing around daydreaming when she should be getting work done. And who the hell does she think she is? The director? Oh man. This is what I wanted. Office Simulator 2022. Let's go. Time is money, friend. Anything for the 
This is horrifying. I think this is literally a nightmare that I've had. This you, you good, buddy? Oh, this man is not good. Hey guys, this man is not good. Jesus. Sure, Leon. Bro, I don't know why they keep me around. Okay, yeah, things are slowly getting more fucked up, huh? Hey. Hey, my guy. Do you guys think this is like an allegory for modern day capitalism? Working a dead end job? Just at the hope of maybe someday getting a break? You miss one? Oh, look, it's Trench. That's how you know this is a nightmare. Let me get these coffee cups real quick. Well, that one's slightly fucky, huh? Wait, oh, what's this? Oh, God, I gotta deliver the director's mail to the office. How to do it. Hey, it's Arish and Langston. Yeah, that's how you know. That's how you know <laughs> Langston ain't into it. Ah, let's see. Find yourself in the director's office. That's the plan, my guy. Oh, great. I was just waiting for my mail. Hey, Trench. Just, please, take the outgoing mail as well. Quiet. We don't have to ask questions like where she's storing all the coffee cups, yeah? Oh. This... No, this isn't me. I'm not me. I can't. Uh oh, I've forgotten something. I can't think. Oh, I'm lost. Oh, where are you? I can't feel anything. I I don't want to be alone here. You're late. Where am I? What Just another day at the office. End. Mondays, huh? Hey, bro. You good? You should keep trying. You are getting closer. All right. I need to go inside. I need to keep moving. Go away. Need the mail.
I am I am getting stronger. I can kick things over now. I wasn't able to do that before. Oh hey Emily. Where the fuck I cannot remember where I got the mail last time. <laughs> oh, it showed up over here, right? Alright, maybe we have to do some tasks for it to show up, yeah? Yeah, yeah, fuck. Get these coffee cups. Your mail. Your mail, sir. Your mail. Hey, you good, my guy? Your mail. Your mail. Your mail. Nice day, huh, Jim? Your mail. Your mail. Your mail. Your mail. Oh, hey, Gladys. Looking good as ever. How are the kids? Your mail. Your mail. 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 Hey, dude. Big weekend, huh? Hey, Doris. See the game last night, huh? It was a real scorcher. Just, uh, scan some forms. Don't mind me. Just, just scanning these forms. Ah. I've unlocked it. The old director's unstable, huh? Some interesting things. I won't let them win. That's how it happened. The hiss got trench first. He turned on the projector. He let them in. I have to remember the hiss. The hiss is the enemy. Ah, I see. That's why he killed himself. This is all inside my head. The hiss burrowing in. I'm trapped in here. They're taking over. All right, hold on. I think the quickest one. Fuck I think I only have to do one. Wait. Oh, I can already go grab it. Hey, ladies and dude. Okay, I'm starting to hear the hiss whispering. I will fight this. <laughs> I will find a way to push them out. Hey, Atsi. <laughs> Welcome back. Hey. Yes. I need my gun. You are a worm, brute. I, the thunder sorcerer. I know what I must do. Start at the beginning. Start your trench. I should have seen it earlier. This is my mess to clean up. My fight. No one else's. I am the director. Ring a ding ding, bitch. Pick up the phone. For the director of the Federal Bureau of Control. That's me. I have sad news. Pedrin is gone now, but it was not a source. It was a catalyst. Do you understand? You must go to my office, the end game. It will be revealed. All right. 
Any goodies? <laughs> We're back. Guys, I think we might still be in our head. Something is, uh, something is just, something's not quite right here. I can't quite, can't quite put my finger on it. Hmm. You guys getting this feeling too? Something might be, uh, a miss. You're gone. Dead. I can't feel you. I can't. Aww. This is what Dylan wanted all along. Poor Polaris. Something. I can feel it, but I don't know what. The motel is a place of power, of change, a place to pass through, of connecting. That's enough of that. Hey, it's me. Wait a minute. Uh. Grow brighter. Jesse Polaris. One constant. They revolve. Hedron is dead, but you're alive. Here, in me. Maybe Hedron put you in our heads when we met her. Maybe you were always there. And she was just trying to teach me how to trick Power you. was inside us all along, Maybe guys. I Maybe I don't need to. Trench was the first to be corrupted by the hiss. Or Trench. Slowly, over the years. His need for control only made it worse. It was Trench who took the projector to the nostalgia department. He opened the door to the hiss. Just like that. With Hedron dead, the hiss tried to corrupt me too. But I'm stronger than them. We're stronger. They're waiting. They'll try to stop us. Getting kind of a Stranger Things vibe from the whole projector thing. Uh-oh. Oh no! They got the board! My sister had this dream. Dylan? She convinced herself that she was awake. She's always been stubborn. But I knew I had to end her dream. I had to wake her up. I had to rip down the poster she can stay in. Okay, so I, I can't go too far down. Dylan, my guy? That's not how we do things. I know he's still there somewhere. I wonder if there's any significance to all of this gibberish. 
I know, because that's how it was for me. Come on, gamers. Prepare for power boost. Yeah, give me the power boost. Level 30? Not me. Ooh, okay. Power boost, though. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. Hell yeah. It does seem to have chosen the things that I have, like, built. So it's not just giving me everything, which I think is pretty cool. That... I must ponder thee. Get pondered, fucker. I'm sure he's fine. Oh, he's back. See, he was fine. Told you. That was another guy. This is a great way at the end of the game to make the player feel like good. Cuz like I could be slogging my way through all of this, but it wouldn't accomplish anything in terms of the feel of the game. Instead, it's best to make me feel just like rad as hell, you know. Oomst dares challenge me. Hello? Oh! Hello? Eat shit! Eat shit! Eat shit! And another! And another! And don't come back. Uh oh. That's fine. I'm fine. Everything's fine. We're good. Oh, hello. Would you sit fucking still? Oh, great. I gotta fight these guys too now, huh? It's always the fucking zombie boys that get me. Just puke all over me and does all my health and damage. Feels bad. Uh. Hold on. One moment. We gotta assume... The buy gamer stance. Roll up the sleeves. Cuff the jeans. 
Fit like a goblin. Are they not respawning? That's also a good touch if they aren't. Because, oh boy. Going through all that again would feel a little sluggish. Although it is strangely empty without them. My friends. My pals. I can't see my pals. Alright. Try this again, huh? Ah, yeah, one of those fuckers, huh? Stealthy boys. Yeah, it's nice that they don't respawn, huh? Where's that stealth boy? Where is he? Could you? Thank you. Got a lovely half second of screeching. Where is that sneaky cunt? Oh, there he is. I'm so glad they used those enemies sparingly, because they suck. Oh, fuck off! Oh, my... Let me catch my bearings here. That bastard's gonna come out and scream at me again, isn't he? There he is! Oh my god, help! Help me! What the who is it? No! Give me the orbs! Yeah, I'm good, I just got spookums. I was not expecting that lad to come out and jump scare me like that. Come on. I have a lad here. Neck long. Throw ready. Nailed it. Could you... Please. My aim is horrible at the best of times. Oh, I got him. Got him. Woo! Oh my god. Whoa! Never done that before. Oh! God, the punches. The punchies. I'm not a fan of when they do the punchies. Come on, there's some orbs back here. Okay. Orbs have been pondered. Oh, God. It's nice to be able to just fucking wreck those guys. Apologies for the silence. I am focusing. I hear more screeching. Oh, I see. We have a first time chat from a bot. Oh, boy. Hey, Julie, you mind banning that guy? You're a mod, I believe.
Where is this guy? Ah. Oh, Dylan. It's time to get down from there. Julie should be able to ban him. Otherwise, I can get it in a sec. Not a huge deal, though. Not spamming or anything. Otherwise, I think the bot would get him if he started spamming. Hey, buddy. Dylan's in a coma. Ah, uh, heck. I don't know if there's anything of him left in there. If he'll ever find his way back. The portal's been closed, but the hiss is still in the oldest house. And the lockdown can't be lifted as long as any trace of it remains. I'm working on a solution with my management team, but there is still a long road ahead. I'm the director of the Federal Bureau of Control. We're in this together. You. And I. No worries. You'll be prepared for next time. Okay. I think this is it, guys. This is the actual one. <laughs> yeah, we can skip it. Oh, look! Ah! Glow up! Glow up! Look at this queen! Oh, wait. No. Alright, okay, okay. I'm gonna go talk to Emily. Shawshank Redemption. What? That's the name of the movie I was. Oh. About <laughs> what a callback. But that talk to the time. board in the hotline chamber. Okay, I'll do that first, I guess. What I really want to do is talk to Emily. Jesse Faden, director of the Federal Bureau of Control. I still don't quite believe it. Got a nice ring to it, huh? But you always knew where we Wrong were way. headed. So the real Polaris was inside us all along. Ain't that just the way? Even if it was a dream. Field darling reached out to me through the hotline. Rector. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> I love the way the board talks. Problem in the foundation. That was Ati's vacation spot. We need to check this out. Okay, but I'm gonna go talk to Emily first. You know I'm gonna go talk to Emily first. Oh, Emily! Hello? I must speak with you. Where are the files on parasitic entities I asked for? I found a couple of relevant files in Dr. Darling's office. 
I'd have to dig through the archives for the rest, but I'm not going through the connector trunk. Understandable. Not with the altered items loose. Then go see if any ranger squads are available for a file retrieval mission. Jesse, good to see you. We've got Dylan situated in his containment cell like you asked. I've got medical staff running tests as we speak, and I'd be happy to walk you through the details later. Other than that, what's next? With the slide projector turned off, the hiss are shut out, but we're stuck with the ones already here. We can't lift the lockdown until they're all eradicated. If any hiss ever got out, that would be the end of it. Well, eliminating them all will take time. Look, I'll do what I can on my end, but my research is progressing slower than I'd like. I think I can help with that. I am making you the head of research, effective immediately. I want you to use everything the bureau has. Every girl power. Every Get these ladies in control. Break the glass ceiling. That's it. Really? I, I mean, yes, yes, I can certainly. Yes. <laughs> yes, I accept. You'll do great. Besides, I didn't really have anyone else lined up. I'm honored, Jesse, really. Thank you. Let's go. Emily, I have more to say to you. Do you remember Mr. Tomasi, the head of communications? Yeah, the guy I blasted. The he was changed into showed up in containment near the turntable. I'll take care of it. That thing's not getting away this time. I've heard reports about his particular use of language and intonation when repeating the his babbling. The biological and behavioral distinctions between different his corrupted individuals is truly fascinating. I wonder if I could categorize the data. And she's already off on her own thing. When the hiss got into my head, I saw some weird things. I think Darling even spoke to me. Does that make any sense to you? Empirically, no. But phantom voices as well as hallucinatory states are not uncommon here. And considering the forces that Dr. Darling was working with, he could have been transferred to a different plane of consciousness, physically or otherwise. And that doesn't upset you? Oh, very. The fact that he hid those forces from me, it's infuriating. But Darling's dream was always to look beyond our reality. This time he may have taken a step too far, but as long as his consciousness can perceive his surroundings, I'm sure he's loving it. Maybe Darling was just trying to protect you from the darker side of his work. Fuck that. I'm not a child. Hell yeah. Just assume I'm going to consider Fuck that. Which it all was. Which it all was, of course. How do you feel about me taking over as director? You act like it just happened. You've been director since we first met, remember? I am still thrilled. Nothing's changed. Not for me. But the Man. hero has changed. Trench and Darling are gone. Their knowledge, anything not written down, disappeared with them. They knew the Bureau better than anyone. They're the Bureau's past, Emily. We won't operate like they did. We'll learn from their mistakes. We'll be better than they ever were. Hell yeah. We won't ever be like them. Well... We'll see. How is Dylan? The same. I, I can't detect any his activity, but his physiology has certainly been altered by it. I can't tell if his brain activity is genuine or simply the aftermath of the hiss, like spasms. Dylan could wake up tomorrow for all I know. I really can't say. Then I just have to wait for him. That's fair. He waited a long time for me. Don't worry. We'll be monitoring him around the clock. If he wakes up, we'll be ready. I don't mean that in a hostile way, just... Well, you know. He wakes up. I hear you. We'll be ready. The isn't exactly popular around here. I hope one day he'll have the chance to change that. So, there was a moment, 
after Hedron died that I couldn't feel my powers. The hiss got into my head. Just for a moment. That explains the HRA outage. Before we knew what was happening, the hiss had us. They were in my head. I saw terrible things. I mean, I was about to go under forever when the hiss was pushed back. The HRAs had come back on. Dylan vanished afterwards, and we fought off the hiss that came after him. So if Hedron's death knocked out the HRAs, that means there must be a new local source for them to relay. Hit me. Which I'm guessing must be... Me. You. Hedron is Man. Dead. Assuming that word Hope and Jesse, they just on the same page, you know what I'm saying? But whatever it awakened in you, the power you call Polaris, is still... One second. Apologies. Active. Or at least, that's what my instruments are telling me. I don't think we're ever going to understand all of this. And I'm okay with that. I'm just glad you're here with me. That's good to know. Thanks, Emily. Alright. One more blurb. Attacking the astral plane and the boar. What was he hoping to accomplish? Huh. Since they arrived, his have been corrupting objects of power, which have an inherent link to the astral plane. Maybe their goal was to access the astral plane and the board itself. That still doesn't tell us why. Huh. His motives are a difficult thing to work out, but I have been digging through confidential files and noticed a strange gap in knowledge regarding the board. Looks like any data on them has either been deleted or was never gathered in the first place. Then maybe it's time someone looked into that. Maybe it is. Okay. Well, I've got a bureau to run. See you soon. Mondays, am I right? Yeah, Director Faden. Please, Emily. What even is a joke? All right. We go see what's going on at the foundation. Ah. Oh, we gotta be a director suit. Right. Come on. Got the multi launch. Some of these. Grab that. I don't know. Just fucking fucking grab all of it. Cool. Whatever. Let's go to the foundation. Work. Quiet. Transdimensional. This place really suits our team. Yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah. Find the door. Wait, am I going? I'm going the wrong way. Gotta go save Atsy. Wait. So that etching is the door. Makes sense. Okay. Let's try opening it. Atsy, you in here? You good, my guy? No time for sightseeing. The board said this was the There is emergency. always time for sightseeing, Jesse. Yeah, I'm streaming a little longer just to finish up uh, control here. I won't be doing a whole lot of the side quest stuff, at least not on stream. Uh, I'd like to just finish i'd like to just see what's up with ati and then uh looks like no one's been down here in a while and then i'll end oh flicker okay don't like that huh. these crystals are kind of pretty emily would be having a Might field day down here a strange one certainly stranger than i'd like 
Director in Northmore now is on a train from Washington. He'll expect answers, which is why I'm making these tapes. Oh. That I'm at least trying to understand. Father searched his entire life for something like this, and we find it one week after he's buried. He always hated irony. Of course, Father, the great director, Ash, would have been the first man in. And look at me. His bookworm son, the supposed head of research who can't stop his legs from shaking long enough to step over the threshold. Ooh. Lore. Uh, no, I'm not really sure what I'm going to be playing next. Uh, I'll have to take a look into my Steam library and my GOG library, just get an idea of things. Bottom of the old hotel. Oh, it's Marshall. Marshall? How is she on the hotline? Unless she's dead. Oh. Jesus. Oh, man. She seemed like the kind of woman who could survive anything. That sucks. Hey, guys. How are we doing? No, that was uh, that was um, Marshall on the tape. Cool, cool gun uh, ranger lady. Call of Duty shooter lady. Something up there. I want it. Hmm. Let's see. Let me run. Can I land on one of these? Nope. All right. Ah, uh, I need. Something to help me get up there. I don't know what I can use, but I don't think I can get up there currently. Before her, I didn't see that. Oh no, on the tape. Oh, that was Ash. Uh, apparently, uh, the guy before Northmore. So the director before the director. So me, then Trench, then Northmore, then Ash was the first one. And that, and that was his son, Ash Jr., from what I was able to figure out. And he was the head of research. Oh, boy. Oh, I could tell I busted. I've got better health than this already. The, oh, wait, that was a weapon mod. Ammo costs while levitating. Nice. Just gonna crunch this up. Oh come on, weapon mods are not full. I just crunched one up. What the hell? Okay, now there's definitely an empty slot. Okay, yeah. I don't know. Something, something weird happened there. All right. As loath as I am to give up those goodies, I must push forward. I see some floating boys out there. Hello, boys. We good? How we doing? You come here often? The colors here are fantastic, huh? The red sand with the...
Interesting. Oh, hello. Oh, new, new boys. Okay, they can dodge. Don't like that. Oh, fuck. Oh, they yeet. Not a fan of the yeet, I must admit. I feel like it's about time for another one of those tapes for more exposition, huh? There's some exposition, at least. Hello? Tip for me, please? Nope. All right. There was a little secret way over here, huh? Let's just get in here. Can I? Can I? Can you? Hey, can I? Hey, can? Hey, can I? Hey, guys, can? Okay, fine. Fine. I didn't want to get in there anyway. Oh, ten. The astral plane is cutting into our dimension. What if this happens in the upper floors? It's not good. It'll destroy the bureau. Oh my god, it auto-targets multiple guys. Control, you just get me. This guy's fucking chunky, huh? Goodbye. I think he's gonna still be here somewhere. Coming back. Yeah, there he is. Hit him with his own rock! I can't not collect the goodies. But also... I think I need to go up there for anything. Check and make sure there aren't any goodies that I can see. I wish I'd brought Emily with me. I could really use my head of research right about now. Marshall? Marshall! You're alive! Well... Wait! Jesse! The 
director. She might not be alive. Just a guess. Whoa. This place is huge. Marshall? Can you hear me? She was on the hotline, so that person couldn't have been Marshall, right? One problem at a time. Let's see what's going on with that pillar first. The nail. Just like a little bit. Goodies. Ley lines. Just real quick. Uh, this. She's looking a lot more sort of in line with the times now that she's uh, in the the power outfit. She doesn't she doesn't look as like uh, as out of uh, of time. <gasps> Personal mod. Definitely looks a bit more 70s. Wait, hold on. I have a punch. Nope. Okay. Well, the punch was wrong. I admit it. My hunch. Okay. I can do that. So I can only choose one? I thought I was done with these tests. What do you think, guys? Me or weapon? I feel like... I feel like yeeting is more fun, yeah? Oh, cool. Honored slash handled. Love that. The board are great. There's so much like funky characterization in them, even though they're they're like just a faceless kind of creature thing. Lock slash key slash MacGuffins. What? Don't do this. Really? Really? I'm a gamer. What can I say? Yeah, I game sometimes. It's just who I am. It's 
my cross to bear, you know? Okay. Let's do this. Oh, come on! There we go. Much better. Ah! I love that. That's very cool. Don't mind me, I'm just out here gaming. Okay, these ones don't look as fragile as the other ones. But I ain't sticking around to find out. Yep, there's there is fragile. It was just a weird color thing. <laughs> Glad I did not stick around to find out. Ooh. Did we do it? Okay, let's review. This broken pillar is called... The nail. It was broken by something, and now the astral plane is bleeding into the foundation, which will destroy the oldest house, the bureau, and everyone inside. Mondays, am I, I right? To find four locks or keys or whatever to stop that from happening. But I'm the director. I've handled worse. This should be simple ish. You with me? Hey, Hexagon. Welcome. You you are joining right at the end of the stream, but uh, I'm glad to have you nonetheless for the uh, short amount of time that I have. So yeah, that's... Um, there looks like there's more to it, to the nail thing, but that will be off stream, and maybe you guys should buy the game and... Uh, Check it out for yourself. I really recommend it. It looks like there's actually a bit more story that I have yet to unlock, so I'll certainly be checking that out off stream. Um, because pretty freaking rad game. I have no clue what I'm going to uh, play next, but uh, I look forward to it. What's up, Mexicon? Maybe one day. Maybe one day, Dark Souls. I still haven't uh, gotten over losing my half-completed Dark Souls uh, Scholar of the First Sin save. It got corrupted halfway through and I uh, rage quit and never looked back. Anyways, thank you guys for joining. I hope you have a lovely evening. And I will see you on Thursday for another stream where I will hopefully be a little bit less loopy and we'll play some fun games toodle pit